Since the launch of the SC1 and SC2 Chuck, we've had a lot of questions come through the office. So part of this know-how series is to show you these chucks in a little bit more detail. So let's have a look. So let's look at these a bit closer. Firstly, I just wanted to give you a scale of the chucks. Sometimes it's difficult when you're just looking at magazines or on videos to actually see the scale against something else. So we've got the SC4, the SC3, the SC1 and the SC2. The SC4 being the 4 inch 100mm, the SC3 3.5 inch around 88-89mm diameter, the SC1 which is a 2 inch body 50mm and the SC2 which is the 2.5 inch 65mm. Obviously they've all got independent chuck keys for opening and closing, just insert inside to rotate round and again right to tighten left to loosen which is the correct way to operate things again just insert and we can open the jaws up easily on the SC2 and as you'll know already you've got the separate key for the SC3 and SC4 so let's get them out of the way now and concentrate on the SC1 and 2 so let's have a look at the SC1 package We've got the 6mm grub screw and leather washer, 3mm allen key, the wood screw, the tapered socket egg cap screws, 8 of, the 40mm dovetail jaw with the oak beak design, the chuck itself, which is 57mm in width, 2 inch in diameter, the chuck key. That locates in the side again right to tighten left to loosen so that's the package you receive in the box what you need to add to that is the correct thread to fit your lathe it's the same insert as we use on the SC4 so it's a 40 mil diameter thread and your choice of thread to suit your lathe in this case the M33 so that turns in and locks up onto the two machine faces to maintain the accuracy. And then what you can see there is a drilled and tap tool to accept the leather washer and the grub screw to secure in place. So that's the package for the SC1. Let's have a look at the SC2. So the SC2 package with a grub screw and a leather washer, 3 mil allen key and a wood screw. The 8 screws for location and the 40mm dovetail jaw with the oak beak design. The chuck body itself is a wider body than the SC1. This is a 2.5 inch diameter or 63mm. It's the same jaw slides so any jaws that fit the SC1 will fit the SC2 but it's got a bigger scroll ring the advantage of that it will actually hold bigger work in expansion, contraction and square stock and obviously the chuck key to complement that locates again right to tighten left to loosen one of the other differences with this chuck is it's a direct thread in this case the M33 to complement the range of record power chucks and lathes also available an inch and a quarter eight an inch eight you can see there you've got the drilled and tapped hole M6 that accepts the leather pad and grub screw to locate onto the spindle nose for safety if you're doing reverse turning with the SC1 and SC2 it's also possible to add other jaws and a faceplate to that. So let's have a look at them. So let's now take a look at the faceplate ring and the three other jaws that complement the range to go with the SC1 and SC2 chuck.